Cowboys, it's not looking good, bruh. They was playing with y'all. They had linemen lined up at receiver. They was doing trick play. Like, this is not good. Dallas is in a world of trouble. And the reason why it's such a big deal is because all offseason, which is not par from course, right? Throughout the NFL NFL offseason, I feel like the Cowboys Cowboys are really the only team that gets talked about consistently. Like during the NFL offseason, like you really don't talk about any other team outside of the Cowboys. That is true. Um even like over the Chiefs who are like the champions like you you just talk about the Cowboys but coming off an offseason where you gave out all this money and this is the product it's not looking good dog it's not looking good man this is bad I could only imagine how Jerry Jones felt after watching this game thank goodness it wasn't home or was it were they home? Hold on, let's click on it. I don't even know. Oh, they were home. This happened on a home game? Oh, this is bad, bro. This is bad. The one hand catch by CD. Mm. Aubrey's kick is up and it is good. So, so I mean, a decent first drive ended in a field goal. Now let's see what happened. It's picked up. Got loaded up. Going deep down the far side of the field and it is caught. Oh, he caught that. So what was good defense? It looked like he just kind of I don't know what happened there. Oh no. Oh. Oh no. Yeah, that was just poor tackling. So, they had a home run. Oh, excuse me, a home run catch. Um what was good coverage? Um he just I don't know what happened on that catch, honestly. I don't know what the defender did. Um, and then just poor tackling right there on David Montgomery, but great running by David Montgomery. Ooh, that was a hell of a throw, a hell of a catch. That was a hell of a catch. Okay, Cowboys, they're moving the ball up the fit. Now, a good portion of these highlights I didn't see. I only saw the clips that's been circulating on social media, um, which I'm sure they're not even going to include in this. Oh. Yeah, I don't know why Dak let that go. He either didn't see that defender or thought he could thread the needle, but <clears throat> that was a bad decision by Dak. Yeah, I love Jamel Gibbs, bro. He's him. Oh, I didn't even see that. That was a crazy sweep. I did not. E I ain't even peeped that. Great kick. So they had a good drive, but then Dak just kind of threw it away in the in the red zone. So you know, okay, but held him to a field goal. Now, how do they respond? Ooh. I feel like if Dak would have waited a couple more seconds for the... That, that would have been over. Here we go, St. Brown. On the cross route. Oh, wow. 
And the flea work, uh, flea flicker works like magic. Um, all that misdirection that you know, I, I you know, as a de as defense, you gotta stay disciplined. Flea flicker, you know, it's a great play when executed properly. It looked like Detroit executed it properly, and um, they pulled it off. So that I can't, you know. Now a three and out. Right there. So clearly by this point, it, it, it seems like Dallas is just looking to, like they're free falling and they're just looking to grab something just to stop the bleeding. But um, clearly the bleeding didn't stop. But yeah. Now it's not looking too good. And oh my goodness, the tackling. They got David Montgomery looking like. Oh wow, just wide open. Just wide open. Damn, he said it's almost too easy. Third and nine on the screen. Oh, he didn't get it. He's short. Did they go for it? They going for it. That's a long two yards. They ran for it and he got it. Wow. Yeah, that that's see when you when you can't get stops on plays like oh wait, third and nine. Oh. Okay. Okay, defense showed up. Now they still in field goal range, but that's better than a touchdown. Offense gotta respond here. You gotta play some complimentary uh football. Oh, Yep. Okay. So you got to respond here. You have to. Oh, didn't get the first. You going for it? Going for it. You got to convert. Wow. That's just great defense. That's great defense. Um, And the pocket was closing. Dak probably could have maneuvered and bought himself some time but that just looked like great defense from what I could see that was great defense and then you give Detroit the ball what would more than likely be the last possession of the game yeah they, they just shot themselves in the foot way too many times not playing complimentary football defense is just giving up everything underneath which I guess I understand, but it's like you're getting destroyed. You should probably play up a little bit. Yeah, this this is bad. <laughs> Did he just do the Disney Channel? Uh, <laughs> this is David Montgomery, and you're watching Disney Channel. <laughs> That's funny. Uh, now, now the offensive line is breaking down. Oh, this is still the first half. Wow. I like in the posture from CD Lamb. He looking demoralized. I guess you'll take it, right? Oh, wow. They got the ball back at the top of the first half. Damn, look at Jamil. Yo. Yo, Jamil Gibbs is him, bro. I swear. Great decision. Great decision. Oh, my goodness. This, yo, I don't know what Sharon Diggs is doing right there. Y'all got to stop, bro. Y'all have to wrap up. I don't know what that is. This bump tackling. I don't know what the hell that is. Y'all have to stop doing that, bro. You have to wrap up. At first, I thought it was just a David Montgomery thing, but it's all of them. Jameer Gibbs is doing it now. Y'all have to wrap up. Like, this tackling is terrible. And just a great decision right there by Jared Goff. That clearly, that was a play-action pass that was meant for something down the field. He didn't have it. He took the check down, got the first down. And Dallas just continues to give up everything underneath. Oh, wow. And then they go deep. Oh, wow. 
Yeah, this is bad, bro. This is bad. Fourth and five. They didn't even show what led up to this. Wow, it is 34 to 6 in the third quarter. At the top of the third quarter. This is bad. And that's just great contain. That's honestly, that's just great contain. Like the, the offensive line actually did decent there. That was just great contain. And then when Dak tried to move up, then the middle of the uh, D line just started to close in. But that the, the offensive line actually did decent there. Boy, if it wasn't for the kicking. Yo, I ain't even peep. It's third and goal, and they already down there. Yeah, you help him, help him to a field goal. But yeah, by this point, D Dallas is completely demoralized. Uh, Detroit has all the ammo and just all the uh, momentum in their favor. It's just... They, now, they're playing how Dallas has been playing. They're keeping everything uh, underneath open, playing back. Uh, even though uh, CD still managed to get in there. Oh, my gosh. Yeah, man. Yeah, man. This is bad. This is bad. Oh, man. Jared Goff is 14 and 21, 273 for two touchdowns. In the third. In the third quarter. There goes Jameson Williams. I mean, they just killing him on them cross routes. Oh, a screen. Look at the play caller. A great play caller. Oh my gosh. That is nut like they played with these people, bro. Oh, it didn't count. They ran another screen. I was about to say if he got it, I would have I just would have turned this video off. Yeah, bro. Trump embarrassing the Cowboys at home on national TV. This is like this is bad. Oh man, Dak overthrew it. It was actually great coverage anyway. I don't think he was open. Oh wow, he should have got in there, but damn. Yeah, Dak just overthrew it. It wasn't open either. But even if he were to make a play, oh. That's a great throw by Jared Goff. He just threw it out there. St. Brown made the catch. And it looked like the reserves in now. Was, is that Dak still? Yeah, that's not Dak. Yeah. Wow, bro. That is, that, this is bad, y'all. This is bad. When you dish out the money Jerry Jones dished out this offseason, and you get this product? Oh, wow. This is bad, bro. This is really bad. This is not good. Somebody getting fired, bro. Oh, my goodness. Even the reserves is getting cooked. The bench is getting cooked. Look at that, bro. They got linemen running slants. This is bad, bro. Oh, my gosh. Oh, my gosh. Y'all, this is bad. This is really bad, bro. This is embarrassing. You got Jared Goff looking like Joe Montana. And I tell you what, 
I don't want to say the reemergence, but just where we are now and like just seeing the Lions the past couple of years and the fact that Jared Goff has been at the center of it. Look, you know, Jared Goff was just a tad bit overrated, you know, his rookie year and when he first started with the Rams and he but I mean he went all the way to the Super Bowl and had multiple chances to win it uh versus the Patriots. And um you know, but quickly he kinda got found out and, you know, struggled his way through it and just to see what he's done in Detroit, he's proven that he's a good quarterback. He's better than average. But I mean, he's I don't think he's that good. And the fact that Detroit out of all teams let him look that good, this is bad, bro. This is really bad. And this was bad on, like, everybody. Not just, like, the no, quote-unquote no names of Dallas. Like, the st- Dak looked bad. Sharon Diggs looked bad. Uh, I won't say C- CD actually looked relatively good from what I saw, but not clearly not good enough. Like, this is bad. <laughs> They was running trick plays. The bench was cooking them. Like, and this was at home. This is bad, y'all. And you consider how bad they struggled versus the Browns. And honestly, I'm going to keep it 100 with you. While I do think the Browns, I I, I think I said it in in that Browns versus uh, Cowboys game. I said, yo, I think the Browns are better than what their record is going to say. But based on how much the Eagles struggled with them, like, the NFC East outside of the Commanders, this is like a runaway for the Commanders. I've never seen the NFC East look like this. In a long time, at least. This is bad, man. Dallas. Yo, Dallas. Yo, this is bad. This is really bad. And I feel bad for Jerry Jones, believe it or not. I shouldn't, because I'm not a Cowboys fan. And I don't care about the Cowboys endeavors. But I actually kind of feel bad for Jerry Jones. This is embarrassing. Somebody getting fired. Soon. If they don't turn this round, turn this around. And I'm talking like next week. Next week better be the best performance from the Cowboys. If they struggle win... Somebody still could get fired. Because this is bad. I, I'm almost 100% sure that some meetings was had today. I'm recording this Monday. Hopefully, I have this up today. There were some meetings that were had today. And somebody's in trouble. If you're a Cowboy fan, man, let me know how you feeling. Let me know how you feeling, man. I ain't going to lie. I actually feel for y'all. In a weird way, I feel for Cowboy fan. This is really embarrassing. And if you're a Lions fan, let me know how you're feeling. I mean, the NFC North, if the playoffs was today, all NFC North teams are in the playoffs. Like, NFC North is one of the better divisions in the league right now. It's, it's competitive all the way through. I mean, you got Vikings kicking ass, hate to say it. We beat the Cardinals, but, you know, we, got, we can only beat who they put in front of us. We 4-2. and two, Looked good yesterday. Got the Lions here. And um, Caleb Williams had his best best performance yet versus the Jags uh, in London uh, Sunday. So, NFC North is, is really, really tough. But the NFC East, <sighs> boy. Yeah, man. I, I don't know. I don't know, man. Cowboys, I got to figure that out immediately because that was embarrassing. I mean, the Lions were toying with y'all in the third, not the fourth, the third quarter they was playing around. It's bad, man. Y'all let me know how y'all felt about this game, man. Let me know how y'all feel about these two teams, how you see the Lions season going, how you see the Cowboys season going. If the Cowboys are not able to turn this around by next week, what do you see happening? If anything, do y'all think I'm over exaggerating? Do y'all think they stick with McCartney? Um, 
I, I don't I don't know. I don't know, man. But this ain't good. This ain't good. Like, comment, and subscribe, man. Let me know how you feeling, man. Uh, don't forget that 75K giveaway. Until next time. Peace.